Hi guys, it's August 18th. Um, today I just was going to come on here quick. I know that there's a few other people asking me for prayer for the um, Christians over in Iraq. And I was hoping that we could pray either or both at 9 a.m. and 9 p.m. You know, I don't think a whole hour, but whatever you can do at 9 a.m. or 9 p.m. or both, um, pray for these people. I feel like God has laid that on my heart, and I wish I could have gotten this video up this morning before 9, but my kids started school. Um, so going forward at 9 o'clock tonight, I'm Central Time, so whatever 9 o'clock is, um, you know, whether it be Eastern or Pacific, um, 9 o'clock will work. I just pray that we can all come together, and if you hear any other times that people are asking for prayer, and you can pray then too, that would be great. I just feel like the Lord is really pressing it upon me to ask people to pray for them. Um, and all Christians that are persecuted throughout the earth. I've got a dog bugging me here. Okay, I received a word this morning. I'm going to go ahead and put that up. Please carefully discern all words. And if you have any um, scripture to go with this, please post it in the comments. My daughter, write these words for those that have ears to hear. My children, the enemy plots and schemes all over your earth now to cause chaos and destruction. He hates my children. He hates my creation. And he is a murderous liar that will stop at nothing to kill and destroy. He is the ruler of darkness and will continue on in his rampage now because he sees that time is running short for him. I call now on all of my children to stand and fight against him in both your personal lives and for the world over pray commune and remain in me and i will come unto you he i'm sorry his defeat has already been accomplished at the cross he cannot win but he can still fight it's up to my children to use the tools i provide for them in order to take his sting away use my power my children for your flesh can do nothing and is a detriment to our battle. You must be filled with my Holy Spirit, Ruach HaKodesh. Listen for your marching orders and carry them out. My children are responsible for letting this world know that I am alive and active and still spreading peace, love, and joy and still standing by and behind my creation as when it was created. Satan has come as a lying thief to desecrate my creation and my children on this earth. He wants no one or nothing left standing. His war drums beat against my children, and now my children must be called up and prepared for battle against his evil. I will not leave you, my loves. Seek out my Holy Spirit and receive his indwelling. Receive his guard over your lives and your hearts. Never let Satan or his minions gain a foothold in your life. Ask for help with any sin you are struggling with. Walk away from the sin and towards your Savior. I have prepared each of you in your own way for this battle that you will face. Do not be afraid, but have great faith that I will bring into your lives exactly what I want you to have at this time. Many of you have been struggling with sin and with an almost a debilitating longing to leave this earth and to come home to me i see your hearts my love you will soon loves you will soon be given your duties and responsibilities and when these are made clear to you you will rise to the occasion with a new found fervor chomping at the bit to do your father's work your sense of duty will surpass any longing to come home right now as you will see there is a great harvest to reap and very few harvesters you will know you're needed for this time and you'll, you will work diligently to carry out my bidding. Do not shrink back from the things I ask of you, my loves. I do not react to the evil one, but he reacts to me. Never lose the fact that I am in complete control. 
remain at peace and comfort residing in my presence and many will see your level of calm and ask you your secret. I am the answer you must provide for them. I am greater than anything the enemy can ever come against you with. I promise to carry all of my children through whatever situations they are faced with. My soldiers will march on and carry out their duties with confidence and bravery in the knowledge that the enemy has already been defeated. Listen carefully now for me, my loves. Know that if you do not yet know me, I love you. I want all to turn to me and receive my free gift of salvation before it's too late. Receive it and it's yours. For my children who know me, walk in my love, peace and joy. Be patient and watchful at the same time, my loves. The puzzle will be coming together more and more every day. Love, Yeshua.